Hello and welcome back. Look at this. Look at this. This should be done by you by the end of this exercise. Yeah. Type in in the serial monitor zero. Zero is displayed. Type in one. One is displayed two. Two is displayed three. Three is displayed four. And you see five, six, seven, eight, nine. This is our goal, okay? This is your your task which you should perform. Therefore, we need this seven segment display. Will be explained, hardware build up, yeah? And then it's your turn to write the software. So, let's get started. Okay, so I will start to to make the hardware connections. The hardware connections can be seen at this at this screen. Remember it. Make a screenshot. Look in the look in the uh, script. Whatever. Yeah. This is what I'm going to build now. Okay. Again, it will not take as long because this one I already it's already there from the last exercise. Okay, let's start. So this is this device, yeah, a so-called seven segment display. Yeah. Why is it called seven segment display? I mean it looks like an eight, right? It's called seven segment display because it has a digit, it can display a digit with seven stripes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay? And this decimal point. And these things, in this case here, these things are nothing more, nothing less than LEDs. So it's pretty much the same like this, this thing here. Okay? So if we want to control those LEDs, yeah, if you want to show a pattern here, preferably a pattern which shows a number, okay? then we just have to replace these LEDs by these LEDs and just let the right one slit. We can again use the, the shift register and it should work. Okay? How to connect? Down there you have the connections. Okay? Quite some pins. We do have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten pins, and I can tell you, uh, eight of these are connected to the plus, and two of these are common ground. So two of these needs to be connected to ground, and the other ones to the output of our resistor, so to to power supply. And then, so there is not a ground for every LED like here, there is just two grounds. You just have to connect two grounds and that's it. Yeah? Okay, so this is this device. You also have the, you also have the, uh, Data sheet, and in the data sheet you find the connection. Yeah, this is also from the script, but you should also have the data sheet in your in the starter slice and in your in your starter kit. And here you have here you have the pin numbers, and there you can see, okay, the above pin is pin number seven. Pin number seven is on the left on the right side, the second one. Pin number six, that's B, that's this, and so on, and DB means decimal point. Okay, so whenever at 3 and 8, so here and here, so at the middle position, we need to place the ground, yeah? and at the other ones, we need to place the plus. Yeah? Place the plus, how far are we? 
original Heinz? Whew, okay, still have to check. Again, the wiring is very much wires, <laughs> underestimated. Okay, so almost there. So I think that's clear uh, for the explanation. So switch again to the original Heinz. Okay, thank you. Okay. Should work now. Should work now. I will change now to the Arduino. I still am using this this program. Let's see. Pin number. Pin number zero. Zero. Okay. That's the top one. Yeah. Let's compare it. A. It's the top one. Correct. Correct, correct. Yeah. Uh, pin number one. Next one, B. Looks correct. Pin number two. Looks correct. Pin number three. Looks correct. Four. Looks correct. Five. Looks correct. Six. Looks correct. Seven. decimal point right okay so this is working you see it was just changing the hardware okay and now if we enter a zero or we enter one we just need to turn on the right the correct the correct uh, LEDs then there will be written 0, 1, 2, 3, whatever number we typed in. We're not turning on just one, we're turning on the correct pattern that this is shown correctly. Okay. Yeah, and then it should work like in the beginning, like you've seen in the beginning. Okay. Next time we are going to talk or we are going to extend this, we are going to extend this, we will use a four digit display, okay? A display with four digits, yeah? The same, the same LED display, but with four digits. It's also working, you will see. So long, thank you very much, goodbye.